So now your next kick is your rear leg thrust kick. If you've got that front leg thrust kick, the rear leg thrust kick's even easier. Now for the sake of the camera angle, I'm going to put my left foot in front. So I'm kicking with the same leg I was earlier, but now it's in the back. With this, it's all the same. I'm going to push my hips forward. I'm going to hit with the ball of my foot or with the heel. My hands are going to be up, but I'm not going to step. So I just bring my knee to my chest and then I drive my hips forward like that. So it's the exact same thing as before, here. Now, when I'm done with the kick, I can come back to where I started, which is probably most of the combos we do are going to have that. But you can also kick and then step down. And as you get better, you can play with both of those. So if you're working with a, a trainer who says thrust kick to cross, I recommend to start where you go thrust kick and then cross here. But as you kind of play with different things, you could go thrust kick to cross here. So I drop down into my opposite stance and try it. So that's your rear thrust kick.